Hello, hello, dears, and welcome back to the channel Benidorm by Anna. Today we are right next to the famous Hotel Pueblo in Benidorm, and it's Wednesday, which means that the famous Wednesday market is on in Benidorm town. Let's go and explore what you can find here in August month and how busy it's actually getting first thing in the morning. Let's go. 9.30 on the clock right now. The sun is shining quite a lot in Benidorm. And this is the beginning of the market. Here you can find a lot of different useful things, both as a tourist or as a local. On the left side, we start to see a lot of swimsuits and bathing suits. Three for seven euros, something for 10, for eight, for 15, for 20. But these are not the cheapest ones that you can actually find. Let's see what else do we have here. By the way, this is the uh, home of aloe very very nice products by the way they have some of the best products for uh, different types of muscular aches best ever after sun aloe vera 100 percent gel they always have it in english so that you could read what it is all about which type of products they have and what is actually used for even gels for tired legs natural soaps natural lotions um, mosquito sprays and a lot more really really recommended cos natural cosmetics then you have some uh, hand fans here these are for three or four euros slightly more expensive than those that we've seen previously here on the market but i mean inflation is here for everyone right some magnets magnets are an important thing if you travel on holidays almost all tourists even us included when we travel buy at least one magnet for us to take and here you have a lot of different options slightly spicy ones as well and the typical benidorm magnets these ones are for one euro fifty so it's not as expensive as in some other places it might be between different bags made of leather artificial bags different types of accessories uh, also from leather or artificial you can check it out and you can always ask them uh, and leather and non-leather are always kept separately we can also find some sunscreen some uh, protection for the sun we can find some lotions for tanning some bags actually quite nice bags all these uh surprisingly or not i've seen on aliexpress which is probably where they get a lot of their products from uh, so bear that in mind but still if you need anything you can check it out here some plates these are they're called uh, plates in spanish which are of typical movie artists movie scenes you can check it out here too 5.99 costs only shoes made in spain this here mostly has shoes for men comfy leather shoes for men and on this side it's more for women all leather they said here made in spain very nice options by the way quite comfy and these ones cost 29.95 normal price taking into consideration that these are made in spain these are authentic great quality shoes that's the usual price for it here we have some cheaper options for bathing suits for 8 10 euros and then 20 or 29 depending on what you would like to have another bar slash cafeteria here for freshly pressed juice some nice breakfast refreshing drinks even some alcohol drinks they serve here together with coffee for example uh, or beer glass of wine they do that too it's not the only bar that you can find here on the market there's another one on this same street the last one of the market and meanwhile let's see some more things there is a handmade jewelry made of natural stones which i'm personally a big fan of i love these type of things and it's going to be a unique thing that only you will have there's no second exact same thing that anyone else will be having there's a lot of toys for children um not all of them are good quality but still if it's just for your holidays 
obviously you can buy it it's cheap and then you can just leave it here if you don't want to bring it back home with you some clothings also for children for adults there's a lot of different options out here including the sportswear if you are a fan typical natural material clothing which is very popular this year and the previous like couple of years a lot of people love it especially night dresses you know something more fancy to put on to go and get some nice dinner in Benidorm or anywhere around the area is something that a lot of people are actually purchasing some nice bags oh look at this five euros that's a good oh that's a good price look at these ones to go to the market or just bring it with you like a small well average size bag very nice ones and i got me one i got me one of these bags very nice um flowery ish one great quality by the way i'm very surprised ne next door neighbors have some fans for the for the air have some hair cutting machines some nail clips and more glasses and sunglasses can be found out here this one costs 10 euros but they are uh, polarized they have specific protection from uv light for the eyes so these are quite good quality doesn't mean that it's if it's market it's bad quality nothing like that here a lot of things do have really really nice quality things some cozy pillows with some kitties and doggies oh that's cute some sun hats with interesting design and here we have some more shoe options everything everything leather 15 27 euros depending on the things some more swimwear and bathing suits obviously summer season here is still not over so uh people are selling them and buying them as well as crazy some bags more bags some of them remind a lot designer bags others are more classic if you would like to get your hair braided right here on the market the price for like the more simple style would be around 30 euros so it's not cheap at all take that into consideration and it will take about an hour maybe a couple of hours depending on the length of the hair and uh, how simple or how difficult the hairstyle would be but there's a lot of points here one of them was this one that we've just checked the other one is at the very beginning right next to hotel pueblo benidorm and in general in benidorm there's a lot of places where you can get your hair braided in summer with some colorful nice pins and summer hairstyle let's continue inside of the market and i'll show you which kind of fruit and veggie seasonal ones you can try out right here let's go fruit is something that spain is really really famous for it's a place where we eat fruit all year around we have a lot of them out here and you can see the prices on the screen obviously it's watermelons melons it's nectarines it's apricots it's different types of other seasonal fruit and veggies that we have here and the prices are quite nice because it's peak of a season obviously it's the time when they are the cheaper ones because naturally they grow in big quantities and they grow naturally uh, with the sun not in winter when they use pesticides known specific like things to pour on them so that they would grow and they are sweeter and tastier by the way typical spanish honey nine euros for a bottle that's not expensive at all trust me for a hundred percent natural honey of the best quality here you also have some dried fruits dried berries some of them cost between two euros for 250 grams and four euros depending on what it is and some sweets uh, sugar free or with sugar then places that i like a lot which are these ones Hola these ones that are um cafe and croissant ham and cheese toasty sandwich baguette uh, orange juice freshly pressed chips serrano baguette vegetable ones drinks soft drinks beer etc they always put it in english because obviously we are in an international town so i love that they have a diversity of different languages so that people will understand it better freshly pressed orange juice and uh, it's like slushy natural slushies okay they cost a uh, one euro fifty or two fifty typical spanish bread options and empanadillas which are these ones right here cost around one euro one euro fifty all this is freshly baked at four or five in the morning and brought here 
Apart from that, this is a real bargain. One piece for three euros, two for five. You can combine them as you wish of different colors, different pieces all together and buy as much as you want and then combine them and change them during summer. Some more freshly pressed juice options and these are also like slushies, um, naturally pressed. One liter of orange juice, five euros fifty. Although it's not recommended to drink such a big amount of orange juice because one thing is that you eat it naturally in pieces and the other when you drink it like this because there's eight different types of sugars and it's not as recommended it's worse for your kidneys and for your stomach um watermelon and melons right here one piece 250 prunes here as well a typical seasonal fruit you have bananas you have platanos from canary islands you have grapes of different types cherries figs obviously uh some oranges uh lemons and much much more here they also sell slushies even from coca-cola wow that's strange some natural materials bags 12 euros that's not expensive at all and then obviously way more different clothing designs and here on the right what they sell is the bags that are made with specific material with which the wine cork i think it's called so this is from which this is actually made look at that how crazy it is by the way the wallets here cost around 10 9 12 euros depending on on the size basically of which it actually is more swimsuits and swimwear you can tell uh, that we are a sea resort that we have a beach and uh, that the summer here is not finished just yet quite busy at 9 30 in the morning in just half an hour or one hour it's going to be almost impossible to pass for these small streets right here some more veggies and fruit paprikas for 1 euro 39 a kilo grapes 1 euro 59 a kilo tomatoes 149 peach varieties and apricots around 1 euro 69 per kilo nisperos the same 169 apples pears bananas and some of the cheapest watermelon that i've ever seen look at how cute it is these are baby watermelons and they're seedless actually these ones are seedless and it costs 59 cents per kilo this is cheaper than in the supermarkets i'm in shock obviously we got to have one of these watermelons for us for the our home for my daughter so i grabbed one and i paid just 90 cents nearby curious thing you have these medallions like the small things that you put uh, for your doggies for your cats with the name they can engrave it directly here on the supermarket and it costs less than 10 euros and you will have unique engraving unique thing to bring for your loveliest animals from benny dog how cute actually this is this is on the last rows, the opposite side from the Hotel Pueblo in Benidorm. Then here we also have, in between the fruit and veggies, we also have some bargain deals. Here you can find clothing pieces for 1 euro, 2 euros, and it's very, very popular. Sun Terrace right here on the right side with some small bar and more slush. Very interesting thing we've just discovered here on the market. I've asked the security because here's the, there is a private security. It's a private precinct. It's a private uh, place. So I've asked where are the churros men, the uh, caravan, like the truck that sells churros. And they've said that they're not coming back until the end of September, probably the first days of October. So if you want to try out typical traditional Spanish churros, sadly, Sundays and Wednesdays market in Benidorm is not the place where you will be able to do so, at least right now in a peak season in summer. So uh, bear that in mind if you want to do that. And the best places would be either the market in Albir on Sunday, the Tuesday's market in Altea, for example, would also be a good option for you guys. Or if you want any of the bars, any of the typical places in Benidorm city center, old town, especially by the beach, is where you can get the nicest churros to try out. Uh, sadly, here, none of them up until October. Thank you for accompanying us on today's informative walk tour down the Wednesday's market in Benidorm, right by the Hotel Pueblo. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you got to see what the prices actually are for the products that they sell right now in the peak summer season in August. And I'll see you in a new video tomorrow. Bye, geez.